Hello and welcome to the Leadership FM video podcast. I'm Stephen Sonsino. Here at Leadership FM, the Leadership Style podcast, I'm sharing with you the seven failings of really useless leaders. I want you to know exactly how you can really inspire your team and boost the bottom line by stopping the seven key things that really demotivate your people. As well as these video podcasts in the coming weeks and months, I'm running some preview teleseminars that you can access for free right at your desk. I'll tell you more about that another time. In the last episode of Leadership FM, we covered the second failing of really useless leaders. I explained how really useless leaders kill emotion. But right now, let's get into the content of this Leadership FM video podcast. Really useless leaders kill explanation. The third failing of really useless leaders is that they kill explanation. They never bother to explain themselves. I've heard some managers often using the words, it's obvious, when patently it wasn't. I heard someone else once say, if you have to ask, then clearly you don't know. The lowly subordinate, suitably chastened, left the room with their tail between their legs. Really useless leaders just don't seem to understand that people see things differently. We all have different experience and different knowledge. And often we ask our people to undertake a certain task and for various reasons they don't understand why. Why is this why really important? Well, it turns out that all of us need three things from our leaders. We need to feel that what we're doing contributes to the overall goals of the unit or team or business. Sometimes managers or operators on the shop floor or people in a remote unit can't make that connection for themselves. Secondly, we need to know why so that we can refine or even radically improve the process. Remember, our people need to have ownership of the how. If we spell out why we're doing something and our people can come up with a better, faster, cheaper way, a cheaper how, then we're all winners. And finally, all of us need to feel from time to time that we're part of something bigger. This sense of belonging, a sense of community. I'll say more about that in the next podcast. In conclusion then, and in the same way that children are always asking why and won't accept just because, So too do our people need to understand why they should do what they do. A good explanation is worth gold to you. You must give a coherent business case. It really motivates people. If nothing else, think of it like a good sales executive regards a good explanation. It can always be passed on to someone else. It helps to make their job easier. So, in conclusion, let me say that as well as setting out what your people need to achieve, you should also explain why till you're blue in the face and in every medium you possibly can. If really useless leaders kill explanation, inspirational leaders constantly explain why. For me, the conclusion is obvious. If a really useless leader kills explanation, an inspirational leader must explain their vision for the business. You must build a workplace where explanation and vision are not buried or skimmed over, but are actually open and clear. This makes people willing and able to invest their best effort in your projects, in your business. And you have to explain, because you have to lead the way. Because leadership is about having the clarity of vision to lead people to higher levels of performance. If it's your job to deliver performance through others for the business, then it's your job to create a clear vision for us all. How good are you at explaining your vision for the business? Visit the Leadership FM website at www.leadership.fm for all the Leadership FM podcasts and for transcripts of the podcasts. They're free. You can also read about the free series of preview tally seminars that we're arranging for you before The Seven Failings of Really Useless Leaders is published in the autumn. Until we meet again, this is Stephen Sonsino signing off at Leadership FM. Here's to your leadership success.